Hi, I'm Robert Scott, and today we're going to show you how to use your grow tap. The grow tap comes with three pieces, the first one being the grow tap, the second one being the CO2 cartridge, and the third one being the CO2 dispenser. So we'll start off by loading the CO2 dispenser. Now, there are two different types of CO2 cartridges. We sell the ones with threaded, but the CO2 dispenser also works with non-threaded cartridges. If you have a non-threaded, it'll work with this CO2 dispenser as well. You just drop it in to the casing and screw the CO2 dispenser onto it. Now, if it doesn't pierce, that's probably because your cartridge is too short. So if you drop a nickel on the inside, then drop it in, that will raise it up just enough and it'll work then. But for the threaded CO2 cartridge, all we have to do is screw this in until you feel a little bit of friction. And then we tighten it on the rest of the way very fast so that we minimize the amount of CO2 loss. After that, we screw the casing back on just like this. And looks like it works. So next up, we're going to attach the CO2 dispenser to the growl tap. All you have to do is thread it on like this the rest of the way. And now your growl tap is fully assembled and ready for drinking some beer. Now the first thing we do is press the picnic lever down all the way and then gently add CO2 from the CO2 dispenser. You don't want to add too much, otherwise it'll just be wasted and leak out of the pressure relief valve. Now once we have our beer poured with a great looking head, we hang the picnic faucet back up on itself just like that to put it back in the refrigerator. Leave extra CO2 to keep your beer from going flat. Cleaning the grout tap is simple. The first thing we want to do is just remove the CO2 dispenser. Then we remove the grout tap from the growler, open up the picnic faucet, and I add just a little bit of soap to the inside. Then using warm water, Rinse that soap straight through. And then we just switch to cold water to rinse out the last any bit of remaining beer or soap. And set it out somewhere clean for it to dry out. The Growl Tap, the best friend your growler will ever have. 